It's time for another edition of Slimer Storytime. Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of Slimer Storytime. I'm Coogie of the West Mission Ghostbusters at Slimer, and this amazing sign that you may recognize from our intro was made by Demona, who is a member of our group, and we want to thank her on this video for making that, so we can take it out to events with us. That's great. We love it. It looks amazing. All right, so let's see what book Slimer's picked out for us today, The Complete Fiction of H.P. Lovecraft. Slimer, while I, I appreciate your enthusiasm, we do not have enough time to to read even a fraction of these stories. Plus, they might be a little bit too advanced for some of our listeners out there. So let's see what else you got. Clifford the Big Red Dog and the Missing Beach Fall. Awesome. Love Clifford the Big Red Dog. Let's go ahead and crack into this. You can find the author and illustrator on the description of this video on TikTok or YouTube. So without further ado, Clifford the Big Red Dog, and the Missing Beach Ball. It was a hot, sunny day on Birdwell Island. Clifford was excited. He was going to the beach. Clifford found his toy. And then he went to Cleo's house. Hi, Cleo, said Clifford. Are you ready to go to the beach? I sure am said Cleo. I'm going to make the best sandcastle ever. Great, said Clifford. Where's T-Bone? Just then, something rolled in front of them. It was a shiny beach ball. Hey, guys, said T-Bone, running over. Check out my new beach ball. Isn't it great? It sure is, T-Bone, said Clifford. We're going to have so much fun with it at the beach said T-Bone. So, together, the dogs went to the beach. When they got there, T-Bone and Clifford played with T-Bone's new beach ball while Cleo made his sandcastle. The dogs were having fun when suddenly... When, the dogs were having fun when a big wave suddenly hit the shore. Splash! Clifford, Cleo, and T-Bone were soaked. Whoa, yelled Cleo. My sandcastle is ruined. That's okay, Cleo, said T-Bone. You can play with us. We're having so much fun with... Hey, where's my beach ball? T-Bone's beach ball was gone. Clifford, Cleo, and T-Bone sniffed around the sand. The wave must have washed it away, said Cleo. Don't worry, T. If we all work together, I'm sure we can find it, said Clifford. The three friends began to search for T-Bone's missing beach ball. T-Bone looked under some seashells. He found a bright red crab, but he didn't find his beach ball. Cleo looked around some rocks. She found a pink starfish, but she didn't find T-Bone's beach ball. Clifford decided to take a look underwater. He saw lots of colorful coral, pink shells, and friendly sea creatures, but he didn't see T-Bone's beach ball. T-Bone was very sad. Where was his beach ball? Suddenly, Clifford saw something bobbing in the water. Look! He yelled. It's my beach ball, said T-Bone. With Cleo and T-Bone on his back, Clifford swam towards the beach ball. But as they got closer, the beach ball got further and farther away. Hmm, I think I need to... I think I need to go a little faster, said Clifford. Hang on, guys. You can see him paddling with his ears. When the dogs caught up to the beach ball, they finally understood why it kept moving. A group of dolphins was playing with it. Wow, said Clifford. They're having lots of fun with your beach ball. While the dogs were watching, one of the dolphins hit the beach ball to T-Bone. 
T-Bone looked up. The dolphins. They were bobbing up and down and making squawking noises. They were trying to talk to him. T-Bone didn't know what to do. What are they saying? He asked. Maybe they're telling us to leave them alone, said Cleo. Clifford thought for a moment. Hmm, I think they just want you to throw the ball back to them, T, he said. So that's what T-Bone did. Then one of the dolphins hit the ball to Clifford. Clifford hit it back. Pass it to me, Cleo called. Again and again, the dogs and the dolphins passed the ball to each other. Soon, it was time for Clifford, T-Bone, and Cleo to go home. T-Bone looked at the dolphins who were happily playing with the beach ball. I think I'll let them keep my beach ball, he said. Keep it, but it's your new toy, said Cleo. I know, said T-Bone, but look at how happy they are. I have lots of other toys that I can play with. I want them to have this one. The dolphins leaped from the water. I think they're saying thank you, said Clifford. You're welcome, said T-Bone, waving to the dolphins. So Clifford, T-Bone, and Cleo headed back to Birdwell Island, and the happy dolphins disappeared into the sunset. Well, that was quite the roller coaster of emotions there with Clifford and his friend T-Bone losing his ball. We hope that you've enjoyed this story, and you can check out this and many other videos on our TikTok, YouTube, and we will be posting more coming soon. If you guys have any suggestions, feel free to message us on Facebook, TikTok, or you can write us a letter and find the link to our mailbox on Facebook. For the West Mission Ghostbusters, I'm Coogie, that's Slimer. This has been another episode of Slimer Storytime. Thanks for watching.